Well, I gotta tell you, I have been so uninspired for the last several days. Um, I came down to work yesterday and I just could not even get started. Uh, just, uh, just the mood you get into sometimes, you just have to work your way through them. I'm still not completely there yet, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and do as much as I can today. I saw this cartoon, and I'm going to put it up here now. It pretty well says everything. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to continue adding clay to this uh, figure of the horse. And uh, hopefully you'll be able to see everything I do. Time to play with some clay. I gotta put that uh, added brace. To keep the clay from uh, tilting on me while I'm working on it. That'll just keep it so it won't be tilting forward as I'm working on the neck of the horse. Doesn't hurt the uh, sculpture at all because I can fill the hole in later. <laughs> right now I'm just trying to get uh, the shape of the neck and then I can start doing the head of the horse. It's a stressful for me today to work on this. I just have no idea why. For some reason, it's stressful.
All right, I've cut back on the, the horse's skull because I think I got it wrong. And uh, I need to get my drawing that uh, is at the scale. And there's no guarantee that these are even right. I mean, these are drawn by somebody else. They're not actually a photograph of the actual skeleton. So I just sort of have to go by what it looks like. I'm just going to get the uh, general shape of the skull or the head of the horse so I can work out the uh, muscles of the neck. And then I'll get a little more detailed on the horse's head later. Uh, slowly working through my uh, inabilities. <laughs> Hey, I, I got new glasses two weeks ago. Or maybe it was a week ago, Monday. Anyway, I got new glasses, and I'll tell you, it's like night and day. I don't need my magnifiers as much as I was needing before. Yeah, that's the sound of the heater. It's going to be a lot more often this winter that you'll hear that. And I'm sorry, but that's uh, how I keep myself warm enough to work. <laughs> it was down to zero here in Montana a couple of days ago. It's up in the, uh, it's warmed up now. It's up in the 30s, which is better than zero, but not much better. And at least the wind isn't blowing right now. I think this is as far as I'm going to get today. And it's only because I got a, a really late start because I just had to build up the, and I'm going to say it, courage to come down here and work on this. It, I know a lot of you think that I've got everything accomplished, but I don't. 
I struggle every day when I come to sculpt because I never know if I'm going to screw it up or not. I must say I don't screw it up as much as now as I used to, but uh, you still go through that. Uh, it's all part of the learning because every day you're learning how to do it, do it. You're you just learn something every day that you work on a work of art or sculpture. I mean, I've got artist friends that uh, are accomplished and went to school for it and all that stuff. And they call me up and say, I'm quitting. I can't draw. They can. They, they just, everybody, all, all artists go through moments of doubt. And the key is to overcome those moments and just uh, rely on yourself and your creator. Because it's from him that all your talent comes. Now, I think I've got the front shoulders pretty good. I'll uh, let it sit tonight. I'll come back and look at it tomorrow and uh, decide whether I would need to change it or anything like that. So I'm going to say uh, a fond good night. <laughs> See you guys next time. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right, see you next time.